Welcome to day 27 of the Trump administration. Today, Andrew Puzder withdrew from being Secretary of Labor um, amid allegations that were later recanted by his wife of abuse. And we currently don't know who's going to be selected instead. <laughs> I'm just thinking about the coverage by Twitter and what I'm assuming are some fairly liberal people such as myself that, well, progressive ideology leaning individuals. And there are those who were practical and said, okay, well, you know, this is what happened. And then there were those that were going, we got him. Yeah, we took him down. That's one down. First Flynn, now Puzder. I take that back. That's two down. It's like you, you didn't get anything. Um, because even though you got rid of him, you're going to get another person in that position who likely will have the same background of being a businessman opposing abortion. And opposing abortion isn't, you know, necessarily the worst thing ever, but there are a lot of um, liberal women who feel men and other women that are pro-life shouldn't, um, you know, have that belief or be trying to tell them what to do with their bodies. I'm an each, I'm an each his own type person, so I don't care what you do. <laughs> but, you know, um, this is something that really was unexpected to me only because we've seen over the last few weeks since this administration started that they don't care who's not getting in and who's not. Someone's going to get in and everyone before this has gotten in. So it's it's as if you're being defeated before you even start. Um, But, you know, it, it is it is what it is. So thank you for watching. Have a good day.